using the using the curveball as a boost in front of a heavier sound. I'm using the crunch channel of the 5150 block pedal. It sounds like that. I'm still patched into the big rock, but I don't have it on, so we're just listening to the curveball when I kick it on. Now, I've got the volume about normal. I got it set on thrash and turned the mids up some, and I set the low end on tight. Here's fat. You hear the difference. You can also use the low to tighten it up. And that's even chunky. Without the mid. That's pretty chunky. And of course, the high works kind of like it would if you were using a tube screamer or any kind of, you know, other EQ. I kind of like that better. It's a little smoother. It? different mid and do a little bit of that boost. The US setting is the lowest so that'll give you a little more of a low low mid punch into your amp. Versus a little floppy that's a little bit floppy right there let's check out this parked wah thing I'm gonna turn it all the way up I know that's kind of exaggerated, but I wanted you to hear what it'll do. Obviously, the cool thing about this, a while you can't do this. You can't turn it down a little bit. So you can actually dial in how how wide it is. If that's a word. Tricker curveball using it as a boost in front of the crunch channel of a 5150. Peace, man.